I think the moment where every everything changed in my life was when I came here to Italy. The first word that I that I think of when I hear the word science is experiments. I I love experiments. Well, today Saturday, we're in the lab, working a bit. CERN is like a playground. Uh, it's people and playing but uh, with a good purpose working and having fun at the same time i always had the dream to go there and it was a dream come true definitely people leaves uh, thirsty of knowledge and i think fcc in general is a little bit uh, a part of that that human curiosity of going further and further and we want to go deep and deep and we want to know why I show you here my usual breakfast is a uh, coffee with cookies always Italian cookies and in a bit I have to run for the bus drive and work today is not a super lovely day it's raining here and I see here some snails in the path I'm arriving at work well uh, today here in the lab we're doing a lot of things and this week has been crazy because we have a conference. Today I'm going to show you, we are in this system doing a spattering right now. And that is a very big part of my job. And here you can see it better. It's all the process, proving some theories, beautiful. What motivates me every day for everything is my family. The most important advice from my mom, uh, I think would be only to persist and to touch the ground with my feet and with my hands the stars. Also, knowing that, I, that I'm doing something that is not only for myself. Something that, even though it's not the, maybe the cure of the most dangerous disease, is something for humanity. It's not only just for me. I am in the transition to become vegetarian right now. Uh, well, but I think it's always important to have a chocolate in my pocket and take it whatever, whenever I need the feel to think a lot. <laughs> and this is Venezuelan arepas. Well, I wanted to show you that usually we, on Sundays, we cook the meal for my husband for all the week. So here, some Venezuelan food. Hi guys. Uh, for the last two weeks, I've started a training program and also a nutritional program. I just finished after work uh, and did everything. So I show you here some of my uh, training things. And also, as you can see, this is everything is turqua. What is unusual about my apartment is that there is a little bit of turquoise or blue everywhere. <laughs> uh, my curtains, my uh, 
pot for the flowers, my everything in my house is a little bit of blue and shiny. And today, after work, preparing some dinner, some fish with vegetables for me, and some chicken for my husband. I hope it will be good. Today I'm in the warehouse of INFN and we're here just to send quoted QPR from INFN to HCB. Wish me luck. We are in the Strada delle 52 Gallerie. Uh, we passed in for 52 tunnels uh, that, it, that were made in the First World War and uh, I show you here a little bit of this amazing landscape. You can see even some snow in the mountains. Oh, yeah. For this weekend we came to Genova to visit our Venezuelan friends. I think the biggest professional um, challenge I'm about to have it because I will present my PhD dissertation probably on by, by the end of this year or beginning of the next year. So I think it's about to come. <laughs> it was very fun. I never did something like this ever. <laughs> So of course, if you like these videos, uh, please follow and subscribe the channel and of course if you like it, thumbs up. <laughs>